Okay, I'm going to show you the oldest trick in magic. They got pictures and pyramids of people doing this trick over 3,000 years ago. Got to be a good trick, right? It's a trick with the cup and the ball. This is the one where you make the ball disappear and it ends up underneath the cup, having gone through the top. I'll do that again. You make that ball disappear and it goes under the cup. See, normally you drop the ball in the cup, the bottom keeps it in there, but I can put it through and make it appear underneath. I'll do it visibly. That means you'll actually see that ball go right through the bottom of the cup. Look, right through the bottom of the cup. Watch, right through the bottom of the cup. Now, if you were to drop the ball in the cup, it just kind of stays there. I bought the trick, I read the directions, I can put it through, make it appear underneath. Now, it isn't there yet. I don't even have to make it disappear, I can put it away. There's another one under the cup. It always returns, goes through the top of the cup. I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, he's got to have more than one of these. Or a very good poem. Well, that's true. If I could get rid of this, I'd have a really good trick. Oh. Right. <laughs> chop cup. Morrissey chop cup.